This is a video about how to change the default font in Zim. On Zim's website, under macOS, there are two lines of code. But for those people who are not tax savvy, such as myself, I don't understand what that means. So here's what you have to do. You have to go to the application finder, find the Zim, right click on it, Click show package contents and the file you're looking for it's called a style dot config. So make a copy of it. Uh, let's go to the desktop and open it with text edit. Here you can see all the lines for uh, configuration what you're looking for uh, here is the default what the font looks like let's do a few examples okay so the title is dark green-ish and let's try the highlight mark we'll make uh, some type of yellow sorry my lack of uh, knowledge on color names and here's the <coughs> let's make a link on that And that would make it some kind of dark blue. And here on the style config file, what we're looking is uh, tag mark. You can see it right now it's yellow and the background is yellow. So now let's find another color for it, for the, for the demonstration, let's find a, a different one, the indigo, okay, seems nice, alright, so that's the name of it, indigo. there and uh, how about tat link now it's blue let's change it to uh, uh, where's the red there we go let's change it to red that's the name Next step is a bit trickier. Shift, Command, and Dot. Meanwhile, click. Okay, that didn't work. Okay, let's try that again. Left click. the library now you're looking for application support oh there we go so we go on that then all right then let's put the file we just added into that folder Open Zim again. 
here you can see all the fonts are changed. That's not nice. I'm gonna change that later. Alright, hopefully this video help you uh, to use Zim better. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.